Hello guys, welcome back to my channel, Tip Tricks and Tech. Today I'm so excited. You have no idea. You know why? Because I'm gonna get the new COVID Pfizer vaccine uh, tomorrow morning. So actually I'm working tonight. So then after this, uh, my, my shift, I'm gonna get the Corona vaccine. I'm so excited and I'm gonna share my experience with you guys. That's what I'm doing this video. So let's go and check out the Corona vaccine experience. I'm taking this video after a day of uh, taking my vaccination. So I wanted to uh, share with you guys uh, my experience and if I had any side effects or uh, why did I take this vaccine so early. So I'm gonna answer all that question. And before that, I just want you to have a glimpse of uh, what I, uh, how was my experience. So here and there, I have a couple of clips and they didn't let me take the video, but uh, I took a picture. So I'm gonna show you all that. So you guys go and check that out first okay so guys i'm so excited and pumped up for this day and i'm just gonna follow this signboard hopefully that will take us to that uh, vaccination clinic and it's around the corner that's what i believe uh so this is our vaccination clinic uh, and look like uh, i mean they cover it with the screen and they look like they have a couple of chairs there for us to vaccinate so this is where you do the registration once you get done with the registration they will tell you to wait and then they will call you in for to get you the vaccine and so i'm done with my registration i'm there waiting for them to call me since it's the first day of vaccination in jersey there's a lot of medias out there and it's a very exciting day for them and for us too Finally, they called me in, they gave me some brochure about the vaccination, what could be, uh, you know, what's the COVID-19, what's the vaccination, and what could be the uh, side effects and everything, and they gave me a card too for the second appointment. After a couple of minutes of wait, finally that exciting time came, I got my vaccine, and I didn't even feel that pinch because of my excitement. So guys, I finally got the shot. I got the shot on my left arm and I feel uh, so good. Uh, just like a flu shot. I didn't feel anything. Uh, just pretty much uh, as of now, I feel good and no issue, no side effects. They want me to wait 15 minutes, so I wait there. Everything went smoothly, no problem at all. So guys, I work at uh, University Hospital of uh, New Jersey, which is in Newark. So we were the first one in New Jersey to deliver this vaccine. Uh, so Governor uh, Murphy, came and uh, he was uh, inaugurating this uh, event on uh, December 15th. I was there for that event and then if you wanna get a glimpse of that event, I'm gonna show you this clip right now. Good morning, everybody. Uh, let's hear it one more time from Maritza Benikas. <laughs> more on you in a minute. Thank you, Dr. Sharif El Nahal, uh, for welcoming us to University Hospital, to your extraordinary team, and, and to you and your colleagues. Thank you especially for your leadership in getting these first vaccinations to our heroic frontline healthcare workers. And now that fight to protect every life moves in an entirely new direction. We are supremely confident in the safety and efficacy of the Pfizer BioNTech vaccine. We are confident in the FDA's action and in the review conducted by the Vaccine Advisory Panel, which recommended that the emergency use application move forward. Okay, so a lot of people have a misconception about this new COVID vaccine. So let me explain to you what is this new uh, COVID vaccine by Pfizer uh, and BioNTech. This vaccine is not a live uh, adenovirus like a other flu vaccine. Uh, they're not injecting any live uh, virus to your body to make an immune response to it. But what they actually does is they in this vaccine there is actually a genetic code so that will get into your body and then your cell in your body will create a protein that will fight against this virus so that will prepare your body uh, to fight against this uh, covid so that's how it works because of that reason i didn't get sick at all in that sense i usually like, every year i take a flu vaccine so after the flu vaccine i usually get uh, muscle cramps fever sometimes and uh, sometimes i feel like i got the flu uh, itself but this time there was no effort at all i mean i i still have little pain in my muscle right there this is where i got the uh, vaccine and um, i still have a little muscle cramp there but other than that i um, i feel so good i feel so energetic and uh, right now i feel so confident than before right now when i go to a patient's room 
I'm, I feel more confident and more comfort uh, in, in taking care of that patient because now I feel like I'm I'm safer, more safer, much safer. And I still use all the PPE, all this N95 mask, face shield and everything, but uh, still uh, right now I feel more safer. If you are a healthcare worker, or if you, uh, you know, if you ever take care of this COVID patient, then definitely you know what I'm talking about. You always, everyone who take care of the COVID patient will have that uh, in their mind that, uh, you know, if you end up uh, getting it. So after this taking this vaccine, I feel uh, my comfort level went up so high. That's a big benefit. Uh, I got this from this vaccine. After this taking this vaccine, uh, you know, I told you this is a day after. What I could say about this vaccine is I'm never, I never had any any kind of allergy that I know of. So I never had any reaction from this uh, vaccine. But what I heard, if you ever been uh, an allergic to any vaccine, so they want you to watch out. But let me tell you though, they all prepared, you know. So when you go for this vaccination, they will take, they will give you the vaccine and then they want you to wait uh, 15 minutes there. And then they just wanted to check out that if you have any allergic reaction to it. So in case if you had end up having an allergic reaction, they have it been ready for you. So they can reverse that uh, reaction right there and then they have code card they are ready for it and it's in the hospital itself so in case in case of emergency you already safe you are safe and uh, you know they are ready to do anything and it is administered by certified nurse and they have so many people i think it's new so they are monitoring the temperature and everything they are they are pretty good uh, in this so first let me tell you how did i end up getting on a first day of this vaccination day so I told you I work at the University Hospital and then we are running a pilot program. We are only one state or public hospital in New Jersey. So we were fortunate enough uh, uh, to have this vaccination uh, first in our campus. After Murphy came and administered to one of our, our first person to get that vaccine in New Jersey was one of our ER nurse. <laughs> If you guys get a chance, please make an appointment as soon as possible. Right now, it's rolling to the frontline worker, healthcare worker, and the nursing homes. But uh, soon, uh, by next year, you know, there's only 15 days left uh, for the next year. So as soon as you get a chance to make an appointment, as soon as it's available to the general public, please make uh, an appointment and get this shot. And feel free you know like i said i'm the living example to you so you know i didn't have any reaction i i feel so confident moderna has a 28 days apart window and uh, pfizer which i got was 21 days apart so make sure when you make an appointment make sure you have two days available so if you are planning to go away or something like that uh, consider that timing because you need to get that uh, booster second shot by 21st day you can I think you can do it on a day before or the day be like I said I would say 19th or 20th day you can do but you cannot go past 21st day so make sure uh, you arrange your time for that so like I told you earlier if you don't you don't have any allergic reaction feel free please uh, go and get this vaccine because we have to get this herd immunity to get the herd immunity we have to vaccinate so many people uh, so of now we have we almost lost 300,000 people in the US so uh, don't just wait uh, take it as soon as possible when it's available to you and if you have any question feel free to ask me I will explain from my knowledge I can uh, you know guide you through this vaccination process and also what to look for and things like that so guys i hope you like this video if you like this video please share with your friends and family um i can guarantee you that this video will give you some kind of knowledge and information about this vaccine and uh, it will be helpful and benefit to your friends and family so please share it and uh, if you haven't subscribed my channel consider subscribing it too and uh, i will be coming with uh, another interesting video till then it's me aldo signing off bye bye
So this vaccine is going to be two dose vaccination. Uh, so Pfizer and Moderna, uh, 